I would consider my family comfortably poor. Our bills are being paid, we have food, but we don't have like what everybody else has. different types of classes of being inside poor. Poor can be multiple people in an area and we're all living under just the wage, of minimum wage every day. It's like, it, it humbles. Some of the factors I would think of being poor or being in poverty would be living comfortably with given money and not being able to live off your own type of money as in working for it or just living as just checks come in as in like SSI checks or food stamps every month. The problem and the factors are just we're given too much but we're not giving enough as in like jobs because you know as when you apply for an SSI check that stays with you that you have a disability and in in the area everyone wants a perfect employee a, perf a perfect job a perfect environment but it's just like we're not given the opportunity to be able to work and get off of the habits we have of living off checks that the government are giving us and it's just like that's another type of way of just the government shutting us up and giving us little side stuff to live off. If I were talking to a politician or someone in that type of program or department, I would, I would give them an experiment. Hey you, why don't you do something? I would tell them to live off what we live off. Make them experience what we get every day. Because I mean, there are some good politicians out there that are fighting for it, but there are people who are very oblivious to the problems we have because they see what they want to see. They don't see what we go through every day as a child. So I would give them like maybe a week or a month to live off what we live off. A strict budget, you might make sacrifices if you wanna look nice, and not eat for dinner. You know, I would at least have them experience our problems. <laughs>